and welcome to another lesson on the Arc Development Kit. Today we'll be covering biomes. Um, biomes basically manage the temperature within a certain area that you specify. Um, I have already made a quick setup here on the uh, basic uh, test map and uh, I'm quickly going to explain you what everything does. So in order to actually create a um, a biome or a um, temperature manager you're gonna go to your modes tab and you're gonna search for you can basically search for biome and there you have it biome zone volume so you normally drag that into your map and then you get a bunch of options here in your details menu well I have already um, placed four of those biome uh, volumes right here and uh, this first one uh, in, all right, so I'm quickly gonna go over the settings that you can set up. Here, you can type in a biome zone name. Also, if you're in game and you're within a certain zone and you press your H key in order to get more details about everything, the biome zone name will pop up. So, if you put something there, it's also gonna display in game. Well, then you got a bunch of options that you can actually um, tweak. Uh, but this one is the normal zone so I haven't uh, changed anything except for the zone priority what the zone priority does it is basically telling the game uh, what is more important what which biome it should listen to uh, if you have multiple biomes mixed in I will show you that in a little bit um, so here we got a hot zone I have created a cold zone and I've created a cold zone that is going to be ignored that has to do with the biome zone priority. So let's actually get to it. If I click on that biome zone volume, you will see that the absolute temperature override, which is going to be the eventual temperature, I could put in a lot of settings here, like I could say it should be minus 50. But if I say that the absolute temperature override it has to be 7, then it's going to ignore all the previous settings that I've actually set. But as you can see here, my biome zone priority is zero, which is lower than the standard zone, which is number one. So, theoretically, this zone is going to be ignored by the game, and the vol or and the temperature will not change. So now I've got an actual cold zone where I've um, did a final temperature addition, not an absolute temperature override, but an addition to the standard temperature and you can set the standard temperature in your day cycle manager here you can see it base temperature at the moment it's on 25 so if we add minus 35 to that we should end up with minus 10 and then I've also created a hot zone here that should put or that should add 30 to the temperature so that should equal 55 and as you can see here prevent crops has been ticked so if you would want to build in a zone where it's super hot but you really want to have a base there well you you can specify if you want a player to be able to build crops here and you can see here I have changed the zone biome zone priority towards 2 so this is a higher priority than the neutral volume and this hot zone is going to be uh, or theoretically this hot zone is going to be prioritized over the neutral one and the uh, the cold zone the not ignored one also has a priority of two so now that I've explained everything we're gonna put this to the quick test so I'm gonna hit play here and uh, I'll quickly walk towards the setting so here I'm now gonna go inside the first zone and now you can see on the left top here where where you got all the stats about the NPCs it says zone normal zone as soon as we go towards the hot zone you can see the zone changing and we're now overheating the temperature has been raised to 55 degrees and uh, as soon as we walk towards the cold zone it should be minus 10 what we already calculated and then we're, now we'll actually move towards the cold zone ignored and as you can see I can walk around in this cold zone but it doesn't matter temperature is still 25 because the priority of this zone is lower than the normal or than the normal zone that is uh, being set there well but let's say we are going to change this cold zone and we're also going to give this one a priority 
of 2. So it's going to be uh, preferred again. And we're going to say, let's put this on minus 20, the final temperature addition. But we still have that absolute temperature override. It's just to show you that it does not matter which settings you put in there. It's going to get overridden anyway. Um, and as you can see, the temperature is still 7 degrees instead of the minus um, 25 addition that we wanted to get on the standard temperature. Um, but that is basically all for this lesson. That's how it works. It's what you can do with the biomes. And uh, if you have any questions about that, about it, post them in the comment section and I'll try to answer them as soon as possible.